Hello beautiful souls, this is Myra with Happy Soul Happy Life. How are you guys? How are you guys doing? So I wanted to um, let you guys know that I put out two videos and they were a little bit, um, I guess you can say a little bit gloomy, a little bit shadowy, a little bit uh, right? But I have to understand and you guys also have to understand that you know, there is a light and dark, right? Without darkness, there wouldn't be no light. Without light, there wouldn't be no darkness, right? Everything that we went through, everything that we are going through is, makes us, us, okay? It made us who we are, right? So, that's what I wanted to say, first of all. Um, but I pulled out these cards and the energy is very beautiful. I really love it. Um, but it was just confirmation on, you know, the two videos that I made. Okay, so for the first card, it was uh, going up. Wanting to grow and experience rejection of perpetual youth. So fear, pain of... You know society not um accepting right what your new passion is you know we have that fear base we need to stay away from that we need to move from that because where there's love and fear they're not in the same place so the fear is just wanting to keep you chained in locked in um you know in that room of no you are not gonna do this because you will just fail it's just make it's just enhancing your fairness and you, we need to step away you know if we have faith that you know everything happens for a reason everything is going um you're going through emotions and things are just falling off your life, uh, people, jobs, careers, you know, how the way you think, then it is a, a, it's the green light to go forward, okay? Just know with the second card, it's you are rare and free. There's no one like you. And just remember that, right? People are afraid um and of what is unfamiliar right what is unknown but we have to step out of the box and actually really once you step out of that fear base and step out of your comfort zone you feel like you can do anything and your creativity is just you know you're getting downloads like you can't believe you know what you used to thought that maybe um, you know, in the back burner when you were younger, you know, you can bring that into fruition. It's whatever makes you feel good, whatever makes you happy inside, whether it is hobbies that you had when you were younger, you can bring that into life, you know, bringing that inner child out. You know, this inner child wants to play. <laughs> it wants to have fun. It wants to experience things in a, you know, in a loving, compassionate way not in a fearful base because that's where it, the inner child has been you know isolated fearful of even moving forward um the other card was you can't go back to yesterday be in the present and that's what i was even in the morning i was like mm, you know these are a little bit different videos uh than what i have made but you know what that you know i was called to do that i really you know at that present moment that was how i felt and that's how i you know saw that i can reach out to uh, you guys uh, because it's not always you know um sunshine and gum drops right how they say that but if we heal ourselves you know, because that's what we need to do to bring heaven on earth. If we hear ourselves heal, uh, then 
what we are healing and how we feel inside will determine how our environment looks okay so yeah for me it's my thing is always trying to have that uh, beautiful high vibration having that beautiful sunshine and gummy drops <laughs> okay um so just what was yesterday you know you can't do anything about yesterday okay be in the present moment every day is a new day if you're having a bad day today then you know oh well, you can always change it uh, because that's your choice this is your reality you are co-creating with the universe okay with our divine source this you know yesterday if it was yesterday you were having a terrible day and you just felt really slum and without any energy you know, you tell yourself this morning, like, oh, this is going to be a good day. Ooh, I'm looking fly. I'm looking good. You know, I am, I'm in my divine feminine. I'm going to make this be a day that it's not like yesterday. And being in the present moment, that's what makes you unique. And that's what makes you heal. And that's what makes you do, um, makes you open different opportunities, um, that are aligned to you okay the other card was curious and curiouser <laughs> sir and curiouser discovering inquiring weirdness and curiosity hey there's always something you know the weirdness that's what makes us our uniqueness right i have a lot of you know different things but i love that about me and there's a lot of things that you have, you know, that makes you you. And if there's things that, you know, s s stray from you, then that's fine because that's your curiosity. You know, at the beginning of my um, spiritual journey, you know, um, for me, my thing was self-love. It was always about self-love, right? Uh, that was something that I really had to overcome and you know other other YouTube videos that were you know going through this journey as well was not so much of a demand of self-love but that did not keep me away from me um, you know telling you guys and giving you this guidance and um, showing different ways that you can um, do your self-love, um, have that self-trust, do that self-care. And, you know, if I wouldn't have listened to my in intuition and I wouldn't have listened to my heart, then I wouldn't have been speaking through my truth, right? So that is whatever you want to discover, whatever uh, catches your eye, go for it, okay? That is something that is telling you something. And just like me, I've been really wanting to know my um, heritage, right? My ancestry and, you know, more things about my grandmother, my great-great-grandmother and my um, my great-great-grandpas. Um, and all I know is, you know, they lived in the mountains over there in Mexico. Um, for what we know, it, you know, I think it's Buchol, uh Indians, uh, but... You know, that's all I know. I am really wanting to know more about my heritage and my ancestors, right? And I know that for one, she was um, like a curandera, right? Things like of, of the spiritual, right? And I am just curious and I'm wanting to discover these beautiful gifts that my ancestors passed down to me right so maybe you are also don't be afraid discover the unknown and you will know that everything that you probably um you know it catched your eye is because it was meant for you it's it's connecting things that you're like hmm no wonder no wonder i like this so much 
Hmm. You know, it keeps you wondering and wanting to discover more and more and more. Okay. And let's see. And for the tarot cards, um, what I see is, you know, your fulfillment, your stability, right? Um, you're finally, you know, you are in that. And with that, you are in your truth. Your stability is your truth, your happy home, your fulfillment. You no longer are going to be worrying about, um, you know, things that are being manipulated. This no longer is going to affect you. You already know what is it that you are wanting and you are going to seek it. And you are done being in a fear-based um um, fear-based uh, knowing right then you're not wanting to move forward it, I mean this was stagnant energy that was keeping you from having your fulfillment having your happy life and you know you're gonna stand you're gonna nurture yourself um, you're not gonna feed the fear you're not gonna feed um Others that might um, drain your energy, you are going to nurture yourself. You are going to be all about yourself, but in a loving and compassionate way. Because in order for you to heal others, you have to heal yourself. You know, you have to fill your own cup before you can be able to share that. Okay? And that's what was um, taught to me from the very beginning of my spiritual journey. And the last one was strength. Knowing that you were able to like take the fear by the horns and, you know, calm that down. You're like, no, 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 no. We're going to do this our way. You know, my higher self way, my self way, the new way, the new me. You know, and what was um, the other oracle cards um, was internal dance, movement, wheel of life, path of least resistance and the flame tree, the start of something new and the message, positive news, positive outcome. If you stay in your truth and you are wanting to become the best version of self, then you are on the right track. Know that, you know, there's great positive things that are coming to you because you decided to take this step. You know, God is always about give and take, give and take, right? It's never about give me, give me, give me, give me, and you don't get anything. That's why in a relationship is always which with everybody, with everybody. It doesn't have to be just a counterpart, you know. Any person that you encounter, it's always a give and take you know because if you give too much you get drained out and there's nothing that you can give and then you're back to square one and back to the, the bottom of the pit right and not knowing how to get yourself out so you guys taking this step is the first step and you, you will get rewarded for this you know at the beginning i was like well, God should not be giving us uh, rewards, right? That was a um, uh, program that, you know, that was, that needed to go away. And it's about, yes, you know, it's about give and take. You know, you are give, having this faith. You are being open to the situations. You are opening to being uh, taken to the unknown to discover yourself okay so that's what you are giving to the lord and giving to the divine source and in that you are getting to discover yourself and what was in the bottom of the cards was um the five of cups um, painting the roses red, covering up errors, and uh, jewel within a teardrop, appreciation, spiritual, and emotional connection. It's time to walk away 
from that, you know, what was, was, it's not any longer, we need to stop dwelling in the past and stop dwelling on what we had, time to be in the present moment and move forward, this is your new life, you know, this is how you still want to continue your new life, no, there's no way that you want to continue your new life like this, um, so, you know, it's time to, you know, stop covering um, things and just mm, stop covering for people. Stop covering for little, um, say, lies. Be true to yourself. You know, if you cannot be true to yourself, who can you, who, how do you expect other people to be true to you? That's what we have to understand. And, you know, connect, you know, right now, you are in a place that you are needing to get assistance. And if it's not from us, you know, as the readers or as the guidance or the counselors um, that can help you in this process, in this journey, then the divine source and your angels whoever you believe in um, and ask them to guide you ask them for clarity and have that intent and know that your answers uh, know that your questions will be answered okay so thank you you guys i hope you guys like this video i really was really impressed about this video it really came from the heart and all I can say is namaste because I see the divine in you and my soul sees the divine in you. So thank you. Namaste.